Hello there, everybody, and welcome to my redown let's play of Legends of the Ocarina of Time. I am your host, here is Link. And if you're wondering why I'm redoing this game, is because I'm not happy with my first uh, recordings. My first attempt. So, I won't delete them, I'll just remove them from the playlist. So yeah, um... Yeah, along with the Guardian Spirit, I'm going to use a tree. <sighs> the children of the forest of Kokiri live here with me. It's nice to hear. Each Kokiri has his or own, her own Guardian Fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Fail. Okay, so... Now we go into his dream. Scary drawbridge. Scary horse. Scary chains. Scary fire. Scary fairy. Ah, that rhymes. There's a bit choppy of the uh, audio there. But anyway. Thou must. Uh, thou must be stunned. Okay, so now we're out of his dream. And back into actually what's happening. Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the Digu tree. Dost thou sense that the climate of evil def descending upon this realm? Malevolent forces even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order to the world. Could I actually read that then? But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems that the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find your young friend and guide him to me. Don't let anyone stop you in the way. Run, Charlie. Run as fast as you can. Did it? Did it? Did it? Did it? No, I don't like that film anymore. I watched it too much. So yeah, so this is the um first-person view of Navi flying, trying to find the Kokiri, without a fairy, which must be the one that we just saw. Who had a dream. And there's a guy humping a rock there. But you know, that's normal. Everybody does that. Right? Okay, so now we found it. You're not supposed to drink before you play a game. That's how you screw things up, Navi. You don't drink before playing a game. <clears throat> okay, so... Navi has found that boy who is not even closing his eyes. Well, that's Nintendo 64, the most epic console. Well, I wouldn't say epic. It's possibly my favourite Nintendo console. Possibly my favourite console, besides uh, GameCube. Wii isn't that bad. It has a GameCube function as well, and, you know, Mario Galaxy, Metroid of the Ram. They're all good games. You finally woke up, I'm never the fairy. Sorry. The Great Decatry asked me to be a partner from now on. Nice to meet you. The Great Decatry is serving you. Let's get going right now. Okay, that was a bad one. I don't know what to do Navi's voice says. Even though I'll try and make Navi not speak as much. Because it's, she's annoying and I don't like to answer her. And that's of course. The game has automatically done that. So there's Saria. Do 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 Yahoo, hi Link. You shouldn't advertise yahoo.com and games that were created before that. Okay, so we gotta find 40 rupees to buy a shield. Because there are a few things that we can't exactly do right now. We can't just go to the Deku Tree. Since there is a guy called Mido. Who will be a bitch? So we have to go and get a sword and a shield. And the shield is worth 40 rupees. Which is why we need 40 rupees. And I'm not going to answer you, Navi. 
shield of say to go see the deck tree. So DQ tree. I think it's pronounced DQ, and I like the sound of DQ better than Deku. So you just gotta go like nuts trying to find rupees around here. And we can get the sword over here. Come on. I've actually learned that if you press A during the air, while in the air, you'll actually go off the target. Because you can't just press B and you'll lock off sometimes. <clears throat> anyway. Indiana Jones reference for the win. Do 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 do. Oh, that thing hit me. Anyway, what could this be? The Kokiri sword. Yeah, so it just tells you where to equip it, to equip it, and all that stuff, and all that good jazz. Okay, so I want to equip it. No, I want to equip it. Thank you. Hurry! Okay. Um, didn't need to do that. Didn't need that either. So, I really wanted to redo this let's play, because it's a fresh start, I've got fraps, it's a much better screen recorder, I got a new con- I got a different controller, which is much easier. I just- I, do, I don't know what you guys think, but I didn't find that let's play good. I couldn't even- I couldn't watch it. If I- if I was other than me, I wouldn't watch that let's play, which is bad. If you, yeah, if you attack that sign, you get a blue rupee. And I actually kind of think that I'm taking too long getting these rupees. Because I can usually get them much quicker. But that's Sod's Law for you. There's a blue rupee over here. Right there. And there's a glitch that you can do, kind of a glitch. If you stand on the end and talk to her. Who are you talking to, you loner? Yeah. Yeah, so if you come over here. There's a blue rupee. And I need one more rupee. Because there's a blue rupee in the shop. There we are. Wow, lag. Yeah, and also there's a few things that I missed in my other LP that I, I don't know, I just didn't like that let's play, I wouldn't watch it, like I've already said, I guess some of you guys would disagree with me, but yeah, so we got the Deku shield, yes, I know I do equip it, can't we skip this please, please I have a wife and two kids, Ah, that's good. The Deku shield. Ah. I think Link looks so cool when he runs forward while holding the shield like this. Ah. If you want to see the Deku tree, you should at least grab a sword and a shield. Duh, look at me. Oh, you got a Deku shield. And what's that? Is that the Kokiri sword? Good grief. Well, even with all that stuff, a wimp is still a wimp, huh? I, the great Mido. I, I actually know all this tech stuff by heart, mine. I've played this game that much, or at least the beginning of this game that much, that I know all the beginning of this text. Or well, at least most of it. So, there's some enemies right here that we can practice our sword fighting on. I'm not the best sword fighter in this game. We got a Deku stick. Deku stick. Deku stick. Boom. Here he is. Great Deku tree. I'm back. Deku tree. Yeah.
That was a face palm. Listen carefully to what I, the great Deku Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of evil gain strength, a vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. Yeah. <clears throat> Got a bit of a sore throat and a cold. A bit of a sore throat and a cold. A bit of a sore throat <laughs> and a cold. Then enter brave Link, and thou too, Navi. Navi the fairy, thou must aid Link. Oh god. Yeah, those exact words is when this game gets worse. Already. I feel like killing you, Navi. Get back here, Navi. Yeah, you hide. Yo, go away. Go away. Okay, I think I, can, think I can start up the Deku Tree in this episode since I'm up to about 11 minutes. What do we think? Okay, these are my arch nemesis. I usually have trouble killing them. But luckily, I did not this time. I forgot my epic um technique against those guys. I used to have this really good technique. But anyway. Yeah, if you are some of my early subscribers, then you know all this. I've explained it before, but I will explain it again. So the Deku Tree Easy Dungeon. Look at this wall, the vines growing on it, give it a rough surface, maybe even climb it like. Yeah, I know. Can't get up there right now. So I'll leave it. Okay, that's a dungeon map. It just, as you can see in the bottom right corner, if I press L, it'll disappear, reappear. You can open the door by standing in front of it and pressing A. Oh shit. Okay. I'm still worried about the time. I don't want to go overtime here. Come on, bitch. That's right. Oh, forgive me, master. I'll give you a clue. Will you let me go? When you jump off a high cliff, if you hold for- Oh, looking. Troll sick forward, you'll run on the ground. Then you won't get hit by the, from the fall. I can't guarantee it'll work, though, so if this cliff is really, really high. <laughs> My reading sucks. Ooh. Sorry about that. <laughs> A pop up just appeared, and it stopped my emulator. Which sucks. So you want. I, I like coming down here. Coming, going this way because it makes the trip back easier. Okay, so this is our first C stick item, C button item, the fairy slingshot. Pretty basic. I'll explain it in my own words now. Any any hour now. There we are. Okay, so in your pause menu, just equip it to whatever. You can equip these if you want to. Okay, what you can do is, I'm gonna hit this right now. If you hit that with a seed, that will drop down, which will make help your trip back. But if you don't hit, th this crumbles down here. And if you don't use it to get over there, then you can use it to get back, which is pretty handy. Okay guys, that is it for this episode, and I will see you guys next time. Take care.